Hey, what's going on guys? Kurosama here. So, I am doing a Plamo review, and I know that's insane. I generally don't do Plamo reviews at all. But, I have these two entry grades that have a bath bomb. So, I want to go ahead and try these bath bombs out for myself and just see how cool they are and also build the EGs and let y'all know if these things are going to be worth your dollar. So let's go ahead and uh, jump into the tub. So Steve and I are in the tub and I'm pretty sure you're ready to get a bath, aren't you? Crow, do you think I'm an amphibian? There ain't no way I'm getting into that water. Okay, I understand. Plus, you might have gotten some rust in your joints, so it's completely understandable. Well, we have the bath bombs right here, and I know for the most part, any other sane YouTuber would have just filled up some water, threw it in there, and then just, you know, messed with the little toy inside. But I wanted to take a bath anyways, so I figured why not go ahead and enjoy myself for once. So let's go ahead and see how this looks in the bath. Okay, so now we have this little capsule thing, and you pop it open, and you get the little gun plug. Pretty cool. So now that the first bath bomb has been dropped, let's go ahead and move on to the second one. And it might actually make our orange soda bath a little bit more orange. And now we have the second mobile suit that is in here. Uh, one thing I wanted to touch on is that you actually just push the parts out and that's pretty much it. There's no nippers required, thank God. So I can go ahead and have a great time, build some gunpla while in the tub, and have a little scenario of a, of a skirmish. So now that we're on a tub, let's talk about these little plumbo kits. Honestly, I just don't think they're really that exciting. They're, they're cool if you really like these particular mobile suits, these amphibious ones, and you want to paint them up like a lot of people do with the Artifact series, then that's cool. I personally don't think the average builder is going to be going for these and display them. I mean, I could be wrong, it could be really out of touch, but these just aren't my thing. So I'm probably just going to give them to some of my members that actually would really enjoy these because me personally, I just don't think they're worth trying to get. But let's talk about the entry grade kits. You are going to have two different choices. You could uh, obviously get both, but they are really just cool entry grades in general. The Strike is a really cool Gundam, very versatile, can do different packs, uh, you can do different things onto the armor itself. but. For the most part, you can get either one and be extremely happy. Um, I think just having the Grand Slam is a really, really cool accessory that you don't see too often in even the high grade line. It's a pretty rare accessory to see on the Strike, even the Master Grade. I don't think I've really ever seen the Grand Slam uh, featured in any of the Master Grades. It's usually more of a uh, kind of like a side accessory. But the Perfect Grade actually does have the Grand Slam, which is pretty surprising. But if you want the deactivated mode, I mean, you are going to get that nice beam uh, rifle and you're going to get the shield. So that's actually a really good perk um, and you can actually combine it with the Grand Slam on the other hand. And you're going to have a pretty souped up Strike Gundam. But honestly, for the price, which I think is about 1700 yen, so in today's currency that's like maybe $13, $14. 
that's really not a lot uh, for a really cool integrated Gundam as well as a pretty nice bath bomb. But that's it for me everyone. I uh, just wanted to go ahead and talk a little bit about these because they've been kind of just sitting around and I really had the desire to talk about them. So glad I did. They're really cool. Go ahead and grab them if you can. I don't really know any sellers that's currently selling these except for Amazon. Um, so not plugging them but just go ahead, try your hand at finding a store that is going to sell these. But that's it for me, everyone. Thank you all for watching. Uh, please go ahead and subscribe if you have not already. I, I try to make content as often as I can. Uh, I'm just so busy and I do like to have a little relaxation. So uh, making content is kind of taking a little bit of backseat. And I'm really just focusing on making great kits and really good painted builds. Uh, other than that, you can catch me on Twitter. I'm actually extremely active on Twitter, which is really weird. Um, but I'm also active on Discord. So if you want to go ahead and uh, hit me up, you can get a Discord invite and come chat with us. But other than that, thank you all for watching, and I'll be seeing y'all in the next video. Bye-bye. What are, you, what are you still doing here? The review's over. Go. Build your backlog or something. You'd be doing the same thing.